Hello, uh, I'm Anandi Subai. I'm the regional um, uh, VP in the APEC region for Tomia. And today I welcome Andrew Block from uh, Spark New Zealand. Andrew, if you can just uh, say a few words to introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Andrew Black. I'm a commercial partner at Spark New Zealand. I'm responsible for the roaming business unit. That includes carrier testing, wholesale billing, commercial negotiations with our carriers and partners. Thank you very much, Andrew. And, and let's start off by understanding, Andrew, from a Spark New Zealand standpoint, what was the main driver for you guys to expand uh, Voltaire globally? Sure. Well. A key driver is to ensure continuity of voice services for our roamers. Uh, more and more carriers are turning off their 3G networks to allow spectrum to be reused. And some are even turning off 2G networks. Without Volte roaming, uh, our customers will be unable to make a voice call on those carriers. Although we've got multiple carriers and uh, multiple carrier partners in, in many countries, losing one can result in areas of poor or even no coverage for our roamers. It can also drive up wholesale costs as roamers may end up on a more expensive network. Being unable to make a voice call or receive a voice call in a foreign country really puts our roamers at risk. Um, Andrew, I'd just like to congratulate Spark New Zealand for thinking about this topic holistically uh, and really leading this industry, just becoming one of the forerunners of Volte Roaming, not only you know, uh, in the Asia region, but also globally and that you know your 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 driver of to ensure continuity of, of voice services uh is really critical in this area especially uh in countries like the united states where large operators are already shutting down the 2g and 3g networks exactly where 2g networks have been retained launching Volte really improves the customer experience because it eliminates the need for the voice the device rather to to fall back to 2G when making a call, and that can result in performance issues, including poor data speeds and a slow return to 4G. Volte really opens up an opportunity to improve our coverage, lower costs, uh, ensure revenue continuity, and, and also establish new sources of revenue. Yeah, thank you, Andrew. Um, we know Volte Roaming, you know, is key to maintaining the same experience from home whilst traveling. Uh, especially in, in, in regions where 2G is available um, uh, and also, you know, it, it drives that ongoing and ensures a better continuity of user experience. And also, as you mentioned, Volte Roaming allows you to also lower your outbound costs, as you quite rightly highlight, highlighted, and helps you maintain uh, also that relationship with your preferred partner who also have decided to choose or choose to close the 2G and 3G network more specifically. So thank you very much for that, Andrew. Um, moving on, Andrew, uh, in terms of your subscriber needs, uh, how critical is it for you guys to monitor, you know, your subscribers' travels? Oh, absolutely. Monitoring is, is critical and it allows us to proactively identify any potential issues in a destination and resolve them before other roamers are impacted. Tomia's platforms are, are really key to our roamers' experience. For example, by ensuring the correct welcome SMS is generated and sent to our roamers when they arrive in a country. And there's a legal requirement in, in New Zealand for that. Uh, as well as steering roamers to the best network based on their location and their device's capability. Preventing a non-capable faulty device from connecting to a 4G only network avoids a poor experience by the roamer or for the roamer and also the possibility of generating calls to our help desk. Um, once again, Andrew, thank you very much for highlighting, um, you know, the capabilities that we provide. I mean, Tomia, um, you know, has been a partner with Spark New Zealand now for, you know, for the last six years, uh, providing you services uh, that are critical, like Spark's campaign and, and IPN steering. Um, with Volte, we're even more uh, acute to the fact that we need to continue to ensure that these uh, services like Welcome SMS is uh, is delivered to avoid any regulatory issues, especially on LTE only networks. Uh, and as far as steering is concerned, uh, we understand and uh, quite rightly we want it's paramount for us to monitor both coverage and device capabilities um, to provide the right level of steering. Um, 
And just to continue rolling on a little bit forward, Andrew, uh, from a business objective standpoint, uh, how are you aligning your Voltaire campaigns against specific business objectives? Sure, well, initially the focus is on ensuring continuity of services with regards to voice calling. But as our Volte footprint grows to cover the majority of our, our most popular destinations, we expect to see new and innovative retail roaming offers emerge. Wow, um, we're really excited to hear more about these innovative campaign ideas that you've got coming, um, especially these days when consumers are uh, long of information, uh, you know, being uh, being immediately available uh, when they're available. So, so thank you for that, Andrew. Sure, of course. Uh, there's also an opportunity to, to partner with 4G only networks, and both inbound and outbound, and that can only be better for our consumers because it improves coverage lowers cost through increased competition for ad traffic and it provides new sources of inbound revenue for Spark. Yes, thanks Andrew. Absolutely. I think with Volte Roaming, um, you know, it, it really is the is, is a key opportunity to increase not only increase but to protect inbound revenues, especially with new roaming agreements for LTNL networks, but also ensure that you know your current inbound roamers uh, that are now visiting New Zealand don't get steered away to national competitors that also offer Voltec. Thank you very much, Andrew. Thank you.